Hey guys, what is going on? Super here today. Come next, guys. The better video today. We are going to be looking at one v ones instead of the normal for my how to get better at sniping series. So this time we're just going to be looking at one v ones, and what better way to do it on Nuketown because it was taken off the season pass a couple months ago. And I feel like it's a very popular map, but at the same time, it's probably one of those maps that's quite like annoying to deal with. But at the same time, nonetheless, it's a very good map for most things and. One of the most infamous things that is an infamous for is 1v1ing. So today, not only are we going to be looking at spots, but I decided to mix it up a bit and start looking at 1v1 spawn traps. So, yeah. <laughs> I mean, and also just some 1v1ing spots to begin. So, first of all, we're going to kick it off with like the normal spawn trap spots. So when you're playing normally, generally this is going to be for like TDM, safeguard, you know, no one ro it's not a ground war rotation, so I'm not going to deal with that, but instead we are going to be looking at just the normal spots. So, I I'm just giving you guys some tips for this. So, when you're just playing normally, right, essentially, if they start spawning over here, which, if you don't know, is essentially when your map control is around here and you're spawning back there. If your map control is at mid and a lot of line of sights are pointing uh, over here, and a lot of people are like shooting the guys over here that spawn. You could actually come around here. This is probably the best spawn trap on the map slide over here. And you can get a really good line of sight over there. Now the only bad side about this is that sometimes they will spawn over on that side. If you're looking at that side too much. That generally does not happen. So or they can just run down this hallway if you miss them. And flank you which can really suck. But the next spot is basically just opposites, except you go over here, hit a really nice clip. If you go into the other spot, it'll mess up the spawn. So, it's probably just better to do that. Now, when you're playing Safeguard and whatnot, there's not... Uh, it's pretty self-explanatory, all the spots, to be honest. I mean, you could go over here when the robot's in mid and you're escorting it, and everyone will pile up, pile up around this bus, even by the red car, but that's basically your only chance you're gonna have. Um... Uh, uh, at, at, like, a decent spot. Spawn traps are pretty easy. So, uh, really, the best one on the map, though, is when you are escorting the robot and you bring it over here. You can come along to this side, uh, and get the couple people that are going to be spawning over here, which will stop the spawn there and start a spawn over there. And it becomes really easy for feeding. I mean, it, I, I've hit... I haven't hit yet on it. Okay, I think I have with the VMP, but does that really count? So, yeah, just quick little combat focus. So, the next spot, or all the next spots are going to be on 1v1s, because domination, this map is very self-explanatory for, and I, I just prefer to talk more about 1v1ing, because I feel like it's something... That not a lot of people actually know about when they 1v1 when I 1v1 them. For some reason, they say they can spawn trap, when really they're not going to very proper spots uh, in order to pull off the spawn traps, and they're not very consistent with it. So now I just like to look at these couple spots. So the first one is generally you're going to be hanging around mid a ton. Now. There's no real questions asked uh, on why you're going to do that, because obviously this is where the life of the map is. The two real choke points of the map are going to be here. And two spots that are in mid that you can can that you can stay by are either by blue car, which is probably the best out of the two, or by red car. Red car, you have a lot more head glitch space, and of course there's like cover over here. But most of the time you're going to be going for blue car because you have a really nice line of sight onto this side of the map. But I have a better strategy. Instead, you can actually spawn trap. And it's pretty infamous how you do it. Uh, but I, just to go over it again. Uh, I, I, well, i never done it on this channel. But just to let you guys know, it's a pretty easy one. And to the people who are not very good at spawn trapping, this is definitely the map for you. So, uh, here we go. <laughs> Basically, when you're in mid and you kill a guy in mid. Or he's on the opposite side of the map. Or by blue card which are essentially the three spawns, you can actually come through this doorway and pick them off. Now, when they start to realize that that's going to happen, that you're going to go over there, there's two alternatives. You can either slide over here and get them, or better yet, just come from the right flank, and it's a lot more consistent. Now, the next spot that you can do is after you kill that guy, then you can come over here. Generally, you're going to actually want to go over to the bus, 
and you're going to want a head glitch over here. And one of two things could happen. They're going to spawn over here and they're going to run through the doorway or they're going to spawn over there, run through here. Or what's going to happen is they're going to spawn on this side. Generally, they're going to run over this uh, to this walkway, but beware because they could come through this doorway and down this hall, I guess you could say, down this kitchen. Is that a kitchen? I I'll check later. Anyways, the point that I'm trying to make here... That's a living room. Good job, Richard. Anyways, the point that I'm trying to make here is that uh, once you get a guy over here, it's going to spawn over here. Now, this is where it gets quite tricky. So, if you come over here, right, and you come too early, they could actually spawn over here. I'm not sure if this is actually a confirmed spot, but from what I have found uh, through trying to do this... Uh, I look over there and no one's spawning, right? So I turn around and I try and get a guy over here, but he's not there. And then I look behind me and somehow he's at Orange House, right? So the only way, like the real only thing that I can assume in this situation is that they're either spawning at this place over here, which is a quite uncommon spot, but it can still happen. Or they're just spawning over there, as I just said. But uh, overall, this is really just going to uh, be the end of this episode. I, I don't know a lot of spawn traps on this map, to be honest. These are just a couple basic ones, and, of course, the ones that, uh, of course, come in with just normal game modes, like Safeguard Dom, and... Safeguard Dom, Kill Confirmed, you know, Hardpoint, and TDM. Hardpoint's pretty easy, uh, in terms of, like, finding people, but, uh, <laughs> definitely not a mode to recommend if you're a bad sniper, but... Uh, in, in, like, not even I play Hardpoint, just to be honest, but, anyways, uh, just to end off this video, uh, I would just like to say that I'm sorry, I'm sorry that I've been away for so long, uh, the reason why I have been is simply just because I've had a lot of time, right, uh, especially recently, with the past two days, but the days before that I was actually at my grandma's house, so I couldn't actually do any videos at all, uh, but... Another thing was that I, I I just sort of wanted to take a break one day for YouTube, and then I did feel very well on the Wednesday. But I'm back here. Depends what time zone you're in, though. So, or which day it is for you, probably. It's going to be weird mixed up, but if you live in Canada, you know what I'm saying. So, guys, if you did enjoy, be sure to drop a like or comment down below. Either one is fine. Sorry for being away for so long, and uh, just... At the beginning of this video, uh, just do what I said there, you know, drop a like, you know, I need more views, clickbait, um, um, that made no sense, but, I guess, <laughs> subscribe if you new, bye guys, as always, thanks for watching the video, here comes the outro, bye bye, mother fudges, this better save or I'm gonna be angry.